Hi guys, welcome back. It's Thursday, so I'm back with another video. If you're new here, my name is Melissa Crafter and I create custom epoxy free tumblers along with other crafts. In this week's video, I'm going to be showing you how I created these beer can glass cups to which I added these vinyl designs to. To add these vinyl designs, I used color changing vinyl from Tech Wrap. This vinyl has a clear appearance and then turns into a different color upon cold temperatures. I really enjoyed making these and this was a fun new way to add vinyl decals to your cups. I like how they gave kind of that etched cup look before adding the cold water. So if that's something that you're interested in, please continue watching. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And as always, if you guys have any questions, don't hesitate to ask that in the comment section. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Really quick, I want to show you guys where I got the SVG cut file from. I did purchase it off Etsy and the shop name is called Billy L. Co. I just searched um, beer can glass SVGs and I was looking through them and I found this one and I really liked it. It was $3.75 and then I went ahead and bought it and downloaded it to my computer. Now that I have downloaded it, I'm going to go and put it on Cricut Design Space. Once on Cricut Design Space, I'm going to go ahead and resize them. I am going to get rid of this one since I'm not going to use it. And I'm going to just resize these three. This one here that says you are magic, I'm going to resize it to 2.5 by 2. And then the mushroom one, I'm going to resize it to 2.5 by 2.5. And then I'm going to resize the rainbow one to 2.5 by 2.5 as well. Once I have these the size that I want, this is going to be a basic cut. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click make it on the right hand side. Once I go ahead and click make it, I'm going to go ahead and drag these down. That way I can match up my vinyl colors according to my mat. These are the vinyl sheets that I'm going to be using. As I mentioned, they are from the brand Tech Wrap. You can purchase these at techwrapcraft.com. I'll go ahead and link their website down in the video description. These are the clear color changing vinyls and these are this one here is a sheet pack. They do also have the vinyl rolls. I do have a discount code with TechWrap. You can use promo code MelissaCrafter10 at checkout for 10% off of your order. I'll go ahead and also link that down below and I'll put it here on this frame as well. This color changing vinyl comes in six different colors. I really love Tech Wrap um, vinyl in general. They are very well packaged and all of their vinyl comes with this um, clear protective film on them. So that's really nice. Here really quick, I want to show you guys how the vinyl changes color. Here I have all the sheets laid out and using a piece of ice, I'm just going to go ahead and run the ice through the vinyl and you'll see how they all change to a different color. So here using my Tech Wrap standard tack cutting mat, I'm gonna place my vinyl down on it. I'm going to be aligning this according to my mat on Cricut Design Space. Once I add my piece of vinyl onto my mat, I'm going to remove that protective film from on top of the vinyl. You do want to be sure to remove that before you go ahead and cut your vinyl. So here, as you can see, I went ahead and aligned my cutting mat according to my mat on Cricut Design Space. You just go ahead and line it up using the numbers on your cutting mat. So here is my Cricut Explore Air 2 cutting out my vinyl design. I do have my cut setting on custom and I am using the holographic vinyl cut setting. And then I did put the pressure on more since this vinyl here is, it is pretty thick. So here my cutting machine has cut out my decals and I'm going to go ahead and weed out my designs. To weed out my decals, I'm going to be using my Tech Wrap tools. 
This one here is the Pink Scales Weeding Pen. And then this one is their tweezers. And this one here is just their squeegee that I'm going to be using a little bit later on. I'm gonna link all of these materials down in the video description for you guys. I really like this weeding pen. It has an easy grip and it does have a sharp stainless steel tip. The tip allows precise weeding down to the smallest detail. So here I'm gonna begin and add my vinyl decals onto my cups. The cups that I'm going to be using are these 16 ounce beer can glass cups. I did purchase them off World Market. Um, I just went into my local World Market and purchased these and they were $3.99 a piece. TechGraphCraft.com also sells these beer can glass cups and they, the ones that they sell do come with a lid. So I'll go ahead and link those down below. So now I'm going to begin and add my vinyl decals onto my cup. Here I'm going to be using my tech wrap squeegee and just kind of using it to place my cup down on it. And I'm going to use an alcohol prep pad to just clean off my cup, take off any fingerprints that might be on there. While that dries, I'm going to go ahead and add some transfer tape onto my decals here. Now that my transfer tape is on, I'm going to go ahead and just remove the backing off of the vinyl decal. And then I'm going to just place this as straight as possible. And then I'm going to use my tech wrap squeegee and adhere this onto my cup. Once that's on there, I'm going to remove my transfer tape. So I'm going to be repeating these same steps for the other two cups. I'm going to clean my cup with an alcohol prep pad and then add some transfer tape onto my decal and then adhere it onto my cup. So this is how my cups turned out. I really enjoyed making these. This was a fun new way to add vinyl decals onto cups. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And as always, if you guys have any questions, don't hesitate to ask that in the comment section. And I do upload a new video every Thursday, so be sure to be subscribed to my channel. Also, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is melissacrafter00. I do post on there daily. So be sure to give me a follow and thank you guys so much for watching.